Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer and welcome back to another video on how to solo queue in Battlefield 5. Today's map on the agenda is Panzerstorm. The map that uh, just is technically the newest map to Battlefield 5. It doesn't feel very new anymore. What is Panzerstorm solo queue? Um, well, the classes I like to use on Panzerstorm and how I solo queue it. Now, Panzerstorm is very hard to solo queue on. It's like Hamada. I think it's a little bit easier than Hamada, but still extremely difficult. So the two classes I go with is the tank and support. Now, this is the only map that I'll really solo queue a tank with because it's very spread out and there's a lot of tanks. So, a lot, you know, more concentration of characters, in-game characters, in freaking players, they're not characters, but a bit greater concentration of players inside of tanks, which means there's going to be less people that can run around your tank and kill you. So, starting off with the tank, if I am in the tank... I am in a tank that I can use personally that can kill tanks, and I focus on killing tanks. So I use the tank to kill tanks. I pick the tank that it... I don't care about anti-infantry, I don't even care about anti-air. I care about anti-tank tanks. And it's going to be different for everyone. Me, I like the Panzer T-38 or the Tiger tank. I don't like any tanks on England's side. I'm sorry, England just has bad tanks. I don't like them. Uh, maybe the Archer is kind of cool, the tank. But I just really can't deal with the England tanks and if there are ammo points I make sure if I'm near an ammo point it's under my control even if I'm losing the objective because if you run out of ammo you're screwed you can't resupply the ammo anymore so in a tank basically you gotta treat the ammo points like they're your objectives but don't worry too much about objectives because you're busy killing all the tanks that don't take objectives so that's really what I do as the tanker now the support is a very unique role for support. Make sure you carry a long to medium range weapon. Something like, for me, I would prefer the Lewis gun or a mounted machine gun, like an MG42. Maybe an FG42, probably not, or a, even a Bren. I want a high ammo capacity, medium to long range weapon. And what I'm gonna do is resupply assault classes. I'm gonna make sure that those assault classes have their gear, because a lot of people play assault on this map, if they want to take out tanks. I also carry the AT grenade pistol um, to destroy cover and kill enemies and also kind of use them to distract tanks. You can take out, if you're lucky, take out turrets, take out tracks with the AT grenade pistol. If you have that aim, do it. That's how you use the AT grenade pistol. I focus on capturing objectives. I, as a single support or even a single assault, can't take out enough tanks fast enough. So I'm gonna focus just being on the objectives. Now, there's one other extremely important thing you do as support on this. You pick the engineer, and you repair tanks. You make sure your tanks don't die. If you start losing tanks, the whole battle is lost. This Panzerstorm is a map based on who can have the most tanks at any given time for the longest amount of time. Most of this map is, out, is played with tanks, not necessarily objectives, excuse me. So, I'll even go as far as, I'll capture objectives, but I'll ride with tanks. Like, if, a, if I see a teammate is using a tank or squad mate a tank to capture objectives, I'll ride with them, I'll repair them, I make sure that tank is in tip-top shape. Because otherwise, we're going to start losing tanks, and we're going to lose the whole game. So that's what you got to treat it. you got to treat it like your tanks are your objectives, or their tanks are their objectives, and you make sure that you have a high objective count, they have a low objective count. That's really how I play Panzerstorm. I like it because that's a unique play style that is to Panzerstorm. I just love, I like how this map focuses, it focuses so much on tanks, it is unbelievable. It makes it so much fun. It's one reason, one of the reasons why I think Panzerstorm is my favorite map to play Battlefield 5 on. So that's really it guys. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed, you can tell me in the comments below. How do you solo queue on Panzerstorm? Are you a sniper? Medic even? You know, medic's vi very viable. You gotta heal all the people that run out and kill tanks. You know, you gotta do that. So, I'm Pacific Cash Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games. And I will see you in the next episode stream, vlog, or Instagram post of whatever I said to make.